Adair is a manufacturer of integrated industrial systems for the aircraft industry and advanced technologies. It is a company that creates and builds integrated industrial solutions. In this video, we'll be taking a closer look at the new Dea TBM. In 2019, Dea debuted the TBM 940, the latest iteration of their single-engine, very fast turboprop aircraft, which establishes new benchmarks with the addition of an autothrottle and an automatic de-icing system, as well as improvements to the cabin's looks and ergonomics. Both characteristics, as well as the aircraft's single-level power control, considerably minimize pilot strain and stress. The engine allows the TBM 940 to cruise at a top speed of 380 mph. The airplane has a range of about 1,660 miles at that speed, and in ideal conditions. It can fly just under 2,000 miles non-stop while burning only 37 gallons of gasoline per hour when traveling at its long-range cruising speed of 290 mph. Temperature of the outside air and the engine, as well as the altitude and barometric pressure, will all have an effect on engine performance. Without autothrottle, the pilot should manually adjust for changing conditions by increasing or decreasing fuel flow in order to maintain a steady airspeed and maintain correct engine temperatures. These modifications take time and diminish fuel efficiency, and they can ruin the engine if made wrong. The Pratt & Whitney PT6A 66D engine of the 940 can run safely and efficiently thanks to the Garmin autothrottle. It uses software to analyze a variety of aircraft and atmospheric parameters before controlling engine power to maintain a specific and safe airspeed. When ice is detected, the automatic de-icing system presents a notification to the crew and activates if the captain does not take proper action. To prevent engine icing, the system de-ices the airframe, propeller, and windshield, as well as triggers the internal particle separator. The avionics display an amber crew alerting system warning, asking the captain to clear the automatic activation and return to manual control mode. Dea's e-copilot strategy of delivering capabilities for increased operational safety on the TBM product line is fully matched with the automatic de-icing safety and autothrottle. Redesigned seats, more thermal insulation for the cabin side walls, a highly centralized shelf featuring side storage, an extra 115 volt electric outlet at the right rear seat panel, and USB ports are among the ergonomic and style enhancements included in the TBM 940's cabin. All in all, the Dea TBM is a high speed turboprop aircraft that embodies safety in disguise. The TBM airframe is made up of a combination of aluminum and steel alloys, titanium, and innovative composite materials to provide unrivaled structural strength and longevity at the lowest possible weight. The TBM aircraft family has always used a fail-safe airframe design, which includes numerous load routes, a crack stopper band, and an optional number of access panels to enhance structural life and subsystem reliability while reducing maintenance cycle times. All TBM variants are fully certified and are accessible today straight around the world. The TBM 940 preserves the same range in handling characteristics that made Dea's TBM 900 series a great success, with over 267 aircraft delivered from the total production of the highly fast turboprop aircraft to date. The TBM 940 is built by a corporation with origins in aircraft manufacturing dating back to 1911, when Moraine Saulnier, a French business, began producing planes. In 1966, the company changed its name to Sakata, which means Company for the Production of Aircraft for Tourists and Business in French. Not quite as memorable as Dea, who bought Sakata in 2009 and initially altered the name to Dea Sakata, eventually setting on just Dea. If you have $4.3 million, this TBM is yours. That's all for today. Thank you for sticking with us, and I'll see you next time.